G'day Peter here from Oz Commercial Sewing Machines. Uh, today we're just going to do a video on uh, uploading a file and printing it out on the ES5 sewing and embroidery machine. So let's get started. Now I've inserted my USB into here after uploading the file from my computer to the USB. Now to be able to download onto the machine what is on this, we go up here to the menu button, push that, and it says import embroiders okay so we're going to hit that button and it shows me what files are on this usb that are in the format that this machine understands so what we're going to do is we hit this button okay so that brings up the file and a full picture of the file that we want to import so then we hit import button down here okay now, when it's imported, it'll come up Embroiders Import OK, and this arrow just backs us out of that screen, and we can then go, there's an X, red X down here, we click that and we go back to the front page. So now we're on the, the, uh, the file that we just imported, so now we can adjust uh, anything that we need to on, these, um, on this file. So what we've got okay so we're going to adjust the color palette to um to what um to what we need it to be so the, we're going to go to this next button to do all our adjustments okay and this button here is the um is a thread reel with a few different colors in a square so we're going to hit that and that is our color palette so for color number one we've got to do A purple so and then once we've selected that purple we're going to hit the plus button here so that then that saves it okay and it moves it to the next one so color number two we're going to do is black okay well actually that's a purple number two is the purple so we'll save that, okay. Now color number three, which is all this light blue, that is going to become the black. So we'll add that. And then the yellow, which is the eyeball, we're gonna make that white. So we'll add that. And then this little piece down the bottom here, it's going to be light pink. Okay, so we'll add that. And uh, color number six, this is the outline um, where the cutout is done for the pattern piece. So what we'll do there is we're going to make that one um, black, just so that we know where we're cutting and we'll add that and we're done so we'll x out of that now so we've got all the colors and everything that we need for that particular eye actually i'll go back in there and change number five that's got to be Yep, we were right, so that's fine. We'll X out of there. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to go and back out of that. So, and then we're ready to stitch out basically. So color number one, you can see is our purple. And you can see that the light has changed from red to yellow. Our foot is down now. Um, you need the foot down to be able to run it. Now maximum speed for the machine is 650 stitches a minute. So what we're going to do now is, and there's a total here of 6,263 stitches for the entire design. So what we do now is once we can do an outline just to see if it's going to fit on our hoop, which it will. So that's the entire size of the design and then it'll center itself. And then when we're ready to go, 
we can just push play and I'm going to stop it um, not after a few stitches and just snip off the excess so here we go so we'll pause there and we'll pull up our end okay and snip it off and we'll continue on This thread as well, this is just regular sewing thread. Uh, I think it's a bit of Gutterman that I had laying around because I don't have any embroidery thread yet. Uh, but it stitches out just fine with that. The fabric that I'm stitching into is uh, minky fabric.
Now we're going to change the thread color. So color number two is black. So I'll just, well, actually, before I do that, let's go. Oh, too late. It's going to try and do the um, the machine cut, but uh, we'll do it manually. Okay. Now we've got just a uh, standard run-of-the-mill Goodman Black because um, we don't have any embroidery threads, like I say. Now. Threading's fairly straightforward on these. Underneath that guide, underneath the back, down through there, up through there. No, I'm sorry if I'm in the way. <laughs> Just a little bit tricky getting down into these and not getting in the way of the camera. Okay. All right, so we have our black threaded in. We'll lower our foot again, go back and push play. And the next color will start. Pause it there and snip a thread. And off we go. that design. I hope you learned something from that. Thank you.